my name is Tita Poinganuk Ratana. I'm from Thailand. <laughs> I'm Yi Chong from Myanmar. Uh, I am studying at the PhD degree at Chulalongkorn University. My name is Muhammad Ivan Fanani. I'm uh, from Indonesia. I'm Aigirim and I'm from Kazakhstan. Uh, I came from Nazarbayev University. My name is uh, Hafizur Rahman. I'm from Pakistan. My name is uh, Faith uh, Fatukun. I started my program in Malaysia. Uh, that's my postgraduate uh, studies masters in uh, applied computing. Uh, my first impression in China is the technology. All the people in China ready to change their habit. They are ready to, to use new technology. Uh, in my country, some people may have uh, a problem of using new technology, especially the old people. Yes, yeah, so this is very, very great in China. Uh, today I have a chance to, to try a chair bicycle. Yeah. So I'm, I'm really, I'm really feel great. When I arrived at Xinhua University, I admire everything, especially as a student. At the time, I think it's 11 and a half p.m. And I saw some student, he is walking <laughs> outside. At the time, it is very cool yeah. who can study outside. That's why they call this is Xinhua University. Long before I came to China, I heard a lot about China. Uh, China keep up uh, its technology, uh, the advancement of AI, and also uh, machine learning. I see a lot of uh, AI achievement exhibition. I saw only before in Japan, but now China can keep up with uh, many advancement. And also not only in robotics, but also in machine learning. I think China, they, they are good in technology. And their AI is very high, and they are trying to make progress. So now I will tell you about something about uh, the Alife in WeChat. I wish in my country this technology come because this is very convenient and easy for doing transaction, to send money to friend, to buy something. And the other impression for me is uh, on the food. I love vegetarian food and this is the best vegetarian food that I ever eat. The food, there's a special kind of, uh, apart from not just eating the food, but I think the tradition attached to the food. You know, the fun, the, the sharing together, eating together, the love, the happiness. Before I tried to learn some Chinese, but I never been in China before, so it's my first I'm here and today I saw like real like what is it, artifacts mm -hmm. from from the history like with the uh, hieroglyphs from the past that you used in the past. Today's visit to a museum gave me an encouragement and motivation to to continue my learning of the Chinese language and Chinese culture. And China tried to make life easy for us you know some people don't have the money to buy the apple product or the big big uh, phones or, or tablets the tablet i use now is made in, it's made in china and it's so nice you see i enjoy it even not so expensive so china tried to make life easy to be sincere i'm really impressed with china's uh, level of development they have gone very far i impress her from the Whenever you see people in China, they will welcome you like a guest. So this is the first country they gave equal status to the farmer. If they are from Africa, they are from uh, Pakistan, India, even Europe. They gave equal opportunity to welcome them. So I admire Chinese. They develop very well with their culture. They, they maintain their culture, they love their culture. This is the thing we need to learn from your people. So I like China very well. 
Yes, thank okay. you. Yes. 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 Yes.